Well, things certainly aren't looking so hot for the Alderson clan. You screwed up another vacation. All is not yet lost, gang. I have a donut. Just have to get it from underneath my, uh... <laughs> baggage. <laughs> Do you really expect me to believe there's no one in there? Elliot, come on. Not this business again. You're really starting to worry me, kiddo. Did you hit your head during our little blowout? Enough of this <laughs> Tell me what's happening. What is this? Oh, that doesn't sound good. On the plus side, I hear jumpsuits are in these days. In times of chaos and uncertainty, when the world feels off balance, we look to those who've stood with us from the beginning. Since 1884, we've had America's back. We may get knocked down, but we'll never get knocked out. Still on your side. Stay calm, collect, and follow my lead. It'll always work out. Car trouble, huh? He's onto us. Run for it. Get here. You're alive. You folks haven't seen a clan of outlaws with a kidnapped corporate exec, have you? Yikes! Upset, son. Seriously, Elliot, it's been forever since that poor cop passed. It's been 12 seconds. It's time to move past it. The future is bright, endless, like that horizon out there. Whatever you're doing with me, I don't care. Just take me back. It's not that simple, kiddo. Oh! Someone help me! I'm a businessman! A very important businessman! <laughs> you gonna tell me why you took him? First you're hearing voices, now you're seeing things. He's right in front of us. We're staring at him. Am I the only one here who isn't bad? <laughs> It'll feel good if you let it. Believing it's real makes it so. Come on. Grab him by the loafers. Oh, please, gentlemen. Ankles instead? The shoes, the Ferragamo. Sometimes lies can be useful, Elliot. Sometimes they protect you. And sometimes they help you get away with murder. <laughs> when the truth is painful, son, and it often is, a lie is the only remedy. It's too much truth, too much honesty, that'll kill you. This whole place is a lie. Nothing here is true. Listen, 
I know your gut's saying not to trust me. But look around. Everything you see, it's all here for you. To help you. You should try just going along with it. This is it, isn't it? You've won. You've taken over. What's that, kiddo? That's what this is. This road trip. This family vacation. I'm buried here. Well, I'll let you in on a little secret. This is just temporary. We did always have a destination. After the beating you took, at least they got you to a doctor. You got yourself pretty messed up. If I were alive, I'd want no part of that agony. Nobody's won anything, Elliot. Especially not me. I'm just trying to help you put it all in the rear view. As painlessly as possible. Bring her in, kiddo. Now that the worst is behind you, it's time we get you back. Maxine, my dog. Started to develop a cough two weeks ago. She got pretty frail pretty quick. Fell over a few times. According to the vet, she danced with the wrong mosquito, got herself a nasty case of heartworm. She's moved to a little room off the basement. Had a water heater for a roommate. Before she got sick, Maxine lived like her own operator. Just seem to cross her mind that she belonged to someone. But in that basement, she needed human hands to give her every scrap of food, every pill, occasional light. <laughs> For the first time, she realized as she continued to breathe because someone else allowed it, that she had a master. And I'm no vet, but I think that realization might have killed her before the parasites had a chance. Anyway, I'm gonna quit yapping, let you rest. Big days ahead work to do. <laughs> <laughs>